Hyprofeeds is pleased to present Always Four Ways for profitable production. It is our hope that the information and demonstrations presented in this video will be of practical benefit in helping you to improve the profitability of your farming operation. Howdy! Today I want to spend some time to talk to you about some ways that we can make this pig business of ours more profitable. us got involved in the pig farming business for different reasons. But I know that every pig farmer is looking to make a profit from his business. I mean, that is why we put up with the long hours and the hard work, right? Listen, you want to earn some good money from this pig farming business? It can be done or not. It's just a matter of approaching it the right way. And there are four things to remember. One, always select good animals for breeding. Two, always maintain good housing for the animals. Three, always look after the animal's health. And four, always follow the right feeding program. Those four things, I'd like to call it the always four ways formula. Practice them and I tell you, you will see how profitable pig farming can be. Remember the first thing? Always select good animals for breeding. It's very important, you know, because producing good stocks for breeding is not just something that happens by chance. No, sir. For instance, there are certain important features to look for in a service board if you expect to get profitable production. The fella should have a good stance with good body length, large, well-formed testicles, and also his hind section should have strong, solid, well-formed muscles. Pay close attention to the distance of the dew claw from the ground. The higher, the better. Then, of course, you'll need to check out his papers to make sure it comes from a good stock. You know, you have to be consistent to earn money from this pig farming business. That means doing the right thing in every aspect of the business. And selecting a good service more is only half of the story. When it is time to select your replacement guilds, check them carefully for certain features. Like service boards, guilds should have a good stance, good body length, and the muscles in the hind section should be strong and well developed too. They should have at least 16 nipples and a well formed vulva. In the case of older sows, Take a close look at how far the dew claw is from the ground. The higher, the better. Make sure that your gilts have a wide body. If you want pork, you can't have a mega animal. Timing is crucial for breeding. And there are a few signals that will tell you when the gilts are ready to mate. For instance, you will notice that they start urinating more frequently and mount the back of the other gilts. You will also notice that their vulva becomes swollen. But most of all, however, when you press down on her rump, if she just stands there, then you know that it's time to bring in the boar. During the gestation period that lasts for three months, three weeks, and three days, check your soul regularly. Remember, she's carrying her investment dividends. Three days before birth, she will be ready to move into the farrowing area. The very best animals will produce large, healthy littles. So selecting the best animals for breeding will give you an advantage right from the beginning. It will enhance your production and improve your profitability. That's one happy bunch, you know. Animals will grow and develop at their best if, among other things, their living environment is clean and comfortable. And it doesn't take much. It is not complicated at all. 
you just need to remove the feces regularly. Then wash the area thoroughly with a high-powered hose. It is also important to apply the right quantity and the right types of disinfectant on the ground and on the walls. Pigs will need just one other thing to be comfortable, space. That requirement will vary depending on the type and age of the animal. Listen, it makes a lot of sense to maintain good housing practices on a pig farm, you know. Remember, the pigs will remain happier and they will grow much faster if their environment is clean and comfortable. That simply means that in just a few weeks' time, you can expect some good monies from them. <laughs>that are used for commercial pig farming operations are genetically bred for weight and meat quality. Unfortunately, these breeds are susceptible to some infectious diseases. No, naturally you don't want your animals getting sick and dying off. That would be bad for your business. So it is important to do all that you can to keep them as healthy as possible. Some things are so simple and yet so important. For instance, Always wash your boots in disinfectant before walking through the pig house. I know that you would never intend to, and you yourself might not even be aware of doing it. But you could be introducing infectious diseases to your pigs. There's some basic things that you can do to maintain your animal's health. Like keeping them cool and making sure that there's always a good supply of clean water. Pigs can't sweat, so heat can cause a lot of stress for them. And remember what I told you before, always keep the pig house clean on a regular basis. When your sows are pregnant, they will need deworming and treatment for mange before being transferred into the farrowing area. Remember, overweight can cause complications in delivery, so reduce her feeding three days before farrowing. Healthy sows are likely to give healthy piglets, so make sure to give them all the medications, vitamins and minerals that they need. And just remember, the high protein is ready to help. Piglets are sort of like dividends or interest payment on your investment. So tend to their health needs the very moment they are born. After their navel cords are cut and dipped in iodine, click their needle teeth. Maintain their room temperature somewhere between 27 to 32 degrees Celsius. Then make sure they get their first milk or colostrum and also an iron supplement. Sometime about seven weeks after birth, be sure to get them vaccinated against swine erysipelas. You may be tempted to ignore your animal's health needs because they seem to be growing well but give them all the medication, vitamin and minerals that they need immediately upon weaning. And remember not to feed the piglets on the day of weaning. It is simple and logical. If you lose your pigs to illness or disease, or if they don't grow as fast or as healthy as they could, you lose. You will end up earning less money or you may even end up spending more. So take my advice and invest time and effort into their health. Every pig farmer wants his pigs to grow quickly. And like any living thing, pigs need food to grow. Now, is there a way of getting growth without losing your shirt paying for feed? Well, there's a way. Always use a right feeding program. Although fast weight gain is important, the more crucial thing is to achieve lots of lean and less fat. It really isn't very hard to achieve, but it involves more than just simply feeding your pigs on tons of feed. Different types and amounts of feed rations are required for various situations, depending on whether you're feeding a pregnant or nursing sow, a service boar, pigs that have just come off weaning, or pigs that are being fattened for slaughter. And remember that pigs can't sweat. So be sure to have a good supply of clean water. And get into the habit of using this simple feeding program. And don't you be caught using anything less 
than the island's best pig feed. There are several reasons why successful farmers use hypro animal feed to achieve profitable production in their farming operations. First of all, only the highest grade raw materials go into the making of all hypro animal feeds, and these are purchased from very reliable sources at the most economical cost. Modern computerized technology controls the mixing and blending process, resulting in an animal feed that's not only highly nutritious, but also economically priced. Hypro feeds are constantly tested to ensure that its premium quality is maintained, and a team of highly skilled technical experts conduct research on an ongoing basis to find new ways to improve this excellent animal feed. Without a doubt, Hypro is truly the master of animal feed. The use of the right feed is an extremely important element in a good feed management program. Smart farmers use Hypro feeds because they're specially formulated to give the best possible results under Jamaica's climate. And the feeding program developed for use with Hypro feed rations prescribes just the right amounts to give your animals at various stages of their growth. So you only spend what is absolutely necessary on purchasing feed. We all know that the most important work on a pig farm takes place in the pig house. But it's going to be difficult or even impossible to do it properly if we aren't sure when to do what or how much to do when. So take my advice and do the thing that is right for your business. Spend the time every single day to keep good records. And just remember this, always four ways. The simple but effective approach to profitable production. One, always select good animals for breeding. Two, always maintain good housing. Three, always look after the animal's health. And four, always follow the right feeding program. Those four things, practice them and see how profitable pig farming can be. Hypro Feeds and its concern for the Jamaican farmer is pleased to have presented Always Four Ways for profitable production. In addition to providing high quality animal feed, Hypro Feel agents are eager to offer technical advice and support. Talk to a Hypro Feel agent to find out more about how you can join the many farmers across the island who practice the principles and techniques in this video and go on to achieve profitable production.